What's up, pink butterflies? It's your girl, Lady Sylvia. So, welcome back to my channel. Today, I thought I would do something a little bit different, and I would do the Get to Know Me tag, because I've never done it before. And I have the questions here on my iPad, so let's just jump right in. Question number one, name, Sylvia. I am named after my maternal grandmother, and though that is a blessing, I absolutely hate this name. It is probably the oldest name you will ever find. Sylvia, Gertrude, and all of them. This is just, uh, uh, mm -mm. where are you from? If you can't hear it in my accent, I am from New Orleans, Louisiana. Go Saints, every day, all day. Who that say they're going to beat them Saints? Hmm. What is your ethnicity? I am 50% Hispanic and 50% black. So my mother and everyone on my mother's side um, are from Puerto Limon, Costa Rica. That is a little small country in Central America between Panama and Nicaragua. I hope I did y'all proud. And then my father is, he's black. He's from New Orleans, Louisiana. Um, he's actually from Hades. No, not Haiti, the French Caribbean island close to Cuba. No, he's from Hades, as in the book of the Revelations, as in hell. That's where he's from, to me. He ain't do nothing for me. I don't know that. I don't know him. Anyway, child boo. Nickname, Mama, Mommy. Mommy, can you buy? Mommy, can I have? Mommy, can I borrow? Anything that starts with my money, that's my nickname. Children. Yes, I have two. I have a daughter who is 18, and she is a freshman in college. And I have a son who is 16, and he is a junior in high school. I am almost home free, y'all. Ah, won't he do it? Birthday. My birthday is... March the 6th, 1974, that makes me 41 years old and fly, what? Um, I am a Pisces. Occupation, I am a retired nurse from the Dallas VA Hospital. Appearance, okay, so they want to know my hair color. My hair color is naturally a dark brown. However, these are clip-ins that I made myself. So whatever hair I feel like I'm gonna clip in, sew in, braid in, that's what my hair color will be for that time period, okay? Hair length. Um, I am natural. I've been natural for four years. My hair is a little bit short. It's about to here. Um, my hair length is up and down. I let it grow. I cut it because of some medical issues I have. Sometimes it just falls out in handfuls. Um, but it is what it is. It's just hair. I'd rather be healthy and have my hair falling out than be sick and have long, luxurious locks. So it is what it is. That's why God made clip-ins, baby. Mm. Eye color, brown, regular old brown, nothing fancy about it. My best feature, I'm going to have to use two. I'm going to have to say my eyes. I know you can't see them because they're behind my other eyes, but if I didn't have these on, honey, or my contacts, I couldn't see nothing. How about I lost my glasses the other day, but I couldn't see to find the glasses. That was just the most ignorant, ew, mm-mm. And then... My other favorite feature of mine will probably be my lips. Yes, they are big, but I remember when I was in like junior high and high school, the boys would always make fun of my lips and call them DSL lips and all this, that, and the third. Now they running for them lips, baby. How about that? Hmm. But it always made me insecure until I was older and I realized that I took what everybody else tried to make a negative and turned it into a positive for me. And I started to look at myself in a different light, all which is explained in my video called The Best You. So check that video out. Um, braces. 
No, I did not have braces. Probably should have gotten some braces, child, but it's okay. They all still within my head. Um, piercings. Yes, I have a few. I have um, two in each ear. I never put anything in the second holes. And then I have one up here. And then I have my nose pierced. Um, tattoos. I just have the one I got when I was 39, right after my 39th birthday. Um, I did so much research on it before I got it. For all the good, good, good Christians out there, I am a good, good, good Christian too. But yes, I do have a tattoo and Jesus was all right with it, honey. So anyway, this is my tattoo. It is a pink butterfly go figure and there's a reason why i chose the butterfly there's a reason why i chose the color pink there in the middle of his body um it is the infinity symbol which um represents love and then underneath is the word bijou which is french for delicate dainty ornate and highly prized all of which are us women okay um, am I right-handed or left-handed? Right-handed all day long. Um, my first best friend would probably have been Antoinette. We were friends in like fifth grade and we are still friends to this day. Even though we live in different states, we are still friends to this day. So that's a blessing. My favorite holiday. Um, if it's a holiday, then I would just have to say Christmas. But I love to celebrate birthdays, especially my birthday, honey. I've been throwing myself a birthday party every year since I've been 27, just because that's what I like to do. If it's your birthday, I am going to spoil you and take you out and just have fun with you because I absolutely love birthdays because I feel like we did not have to be here for yet another year, but God's grace let us be. So I love birthdays. A favorite movie. Hands down, Medea's family reunion. There was so many things in that movie that spoke to me personally. So hands down, that is my favorite movie. Followed very closely by um, The Best Man. Uh, let's see. Favorite TV show. I'm pretty much basic like every other person. I like Scandal. I like How to Get Away with Murder. Um, recently, I fell in love with Quantico, um, Criminal Minds. Girl, I just like TV. I really need some therapy. I really like TV. This don't make no sense. Um, favorite color, anything in the like natural or neutral color schemes, greens, golds, browns, burgundies, beige, just anything that's warm and comforting kind of. I don't know if that makes any sense, but that's the colors I like. You asked, I answered, okay? Uh, favorite song? Okay. <laughs> because I am a multifaceted, complex person, I had to break this question down into three parts. So favorite song, if it's a gospel song we talking about, Big Bay, hands down. Walter Hawkins and the Love Alive Fellowship Choir, something like that, but baby... Walter Hawkins, thank you. Huh, you want to bring it in? Bring him in. Baby, put that song on. Yes. Um, favorite like RB song, anything that Brian McKnight sings. I don't care if that man open up the phone book and start singing. Anything Brian McKnight does is perfection. And then um, I do like a little trap music at the same time. So I'm thinking right now, my favorite trap music is probably um anything about fatty wop uh 679 trap queen um ooh 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 whatever the hell that song is called I, I I'm down for all of that I'm here for all of that I'm here for the gospel I'm here for the RB I'm here for alternative I'm here for all of that anything I'm here for it all baby okay favorite food I'm from New Orleans, so anything in New Orleans, cuisine or Creole cuisine. Favorite store, Walmart, duh. Uh, any hobbies or interests? Everything. You name it, I like it. I like to play in makeup. I like to dibble and dabble in, you know, kind of night fashion. I'm no fashion guru. Honey, 
I am no makeup guru, but I can do a little something something when I want to. Today was not one of those days. Um, I am an excellent administrator. I'm an excellent event planner. I had my own event planning business for a couple years until I got sick. Um, but yeah, anything in event planning, anything in um, organization, I'm here for that. Like all day long. I love it. It's retarded. I love it. Just, baby, give me some gum and a bottle of water and just tell me you need your closet fixed and organ. That's I live for that kind of stuff. I know I'm a nerd, but what you want me to see? Okay, um, let's see. Dreams and goals. I would one day love to have my own event center. Um, birthday parties, weddings, quinceaneras, retirement parties, whatever it is. Come on down there, put your money on the books and let me throw you an event. Um, am I single or married? I am single. I have been single since my son was two. And he is 16. That's a whole nother video, y'all. But I'm good. I'm not sad about it. I'm not mad about it. I'm not depressed about it. Now, I done been all of those before. Trust me, because it's been 14 years. So I done been all of those before. But I'm just at the place in my life right now where I am happy. I am happy about me. I'm happy and excited about my kids and their future. And I am just in a comfortable place. And truth be told, I don't know that I want to share my closet. Mm -hmm. But whatever God's will is, that's I'm going to be happy with that. I mean, it is what it is. But the most important thing is that I think that I am whole, I am healed, and I'm happy. So, and what am I currently wearing is the last question. Um, I'm just wearing some little sandals, some jeans. Honey, I done gained about 12 pounds, so it was a struggle getting in these jeans this morning. I had an appointment at the VA, and then I'm just wearing this little shirt. Little Brooklyn shirt. Um, let's see. Just a stud up here. Butterfly earrings and butterfly necklace. Yeah. Nothing. Butterfly ring and my Florida de lis ring because I rep New Orleans all day, every day. So that was my get to know me video. I hope you guys enjoyed. This was fun to make. Got to reacquaint myself with me how about that so y'all have a blessed day and i will see y'all in the next video